Hello, it's Emilia here. I invite you today to create with me a round home decor or a handmade gift. I'm creating it for someone special who loves the uh, nature and autumn colors. And for this uh, panel, I will use my own collection recently released with Stamperia called Golden Harmony. I absolutely love the collection. <laughs> no, not because it's something I designed, but uh, it looks really lovely. It has lovely elements and I'm so uh, happy to be using that and um, hope you will fall in love with it as well. My panel is about 20 centimeters. If you don't have anything like that, you can easily create it with the cardboard. You can use a plate as a template, like a, you know, breakfast plate or um, what else? Any back card of the sketch pad. They usually have a thick Mm, chipboard bags, you could use that to create a panel. I had this one in my stash for a long time, so decided to finally use it. Today I am experimenting a little bit. Instead of using a uh, craft glue, I use rice paper glue to attach the papers to the panel. I was wondering how that would work and actually it worked really well. So um, yes, <laughs> a little experiment uh, without a failure, so I'm happy. And for to add a texture to my paper, I'm going to use embossing ink and a white embossing powder with a stencil from Golden Harmony collection. The products will be listed below the video, so if you are wondering, um, you know, what I'm using, please check there. I added more embossing later uh, on the edge of the panel because decided that that uh, one decor wasn't enough for my composition. To embellish the project, I'm going to use all the products from Golden Harmony collection. I have some stamped leaves. I stamped them with our, um, permanent ink and then inked the edges. You can stamp it on a colored card or you can stamp them and then ink them with, you know, various inks. I did it on a green paper just to save time on inking. And then I have some uh, wooden elements. I've got uh, the little wood is a dry clay element, some bits and pieces which I cut out of the collection or out of the papers and also some chipboard, some die cuts. The paper cutouts, which are also the new product in the Stamperia, there are double-sided, which is amazing. And um, yeah, so these are very easy to use because they come lots of elements in one sheet. You just push them out. Very, very easy. I'm placing my composition where those two papers meet. I will use smaller and larger elements. I will play with them a little bit before attaching everything. And uh, the, comp the collection has a lot of little elements which you can use for any projects. Lots of little envelopes, cards, postcards. I just love them.
What I love the most about that leaf stamp is that a stamped image you can divide into smaller pieces and out of one branch you can have two or three pieces which can go in different places on your project. To add a bit of texture to my panel I took a twine, folded it three times around 20 cm long, added three knots and unfortunately I didn't record placing it on the project because uh, the camera went blurry. <laughs> so uh, you won't see that but I kind of push it um, underneath some of the elements and it goes from one side to another and then I will use small chipboard pieces from Golden Harmony collection. I took that large branch and I'm dividing it into smaller leaves and then I will put in few places around the composition. And this will be almost it. I'm going to ink the edges with dark coffee ink and then I will add some splats of white acrylic paint mixed with water. Of course, if you don't like a sp a splats of paint on your project, skip that step. And this will be it. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you like the project and I really hope you will like the Golden Harmony collection. Please let me know in the comment and I hope you will be back for more videos soon. Thanks a lot everyone. Have a lovely creative day. Bye bye!